Good morning, ladies and gents. It's been a while. As you can see, we are in the little bus. We are on the way to... I have no idea where it is. <laughs> uh, it's some place in Germany. Uh, Felix, the guy who helped us putting down the cab and getting it picked up to be on the way to Lithuania. Um, which means the cab is back. We are on the way to pick it up. Have a look how it looks. I've seen pictures, but I've not seen it in person yet. So we will see how that thing looks like and how good of a job the guys did in Lithuania. I'm still overdue to release the video uh, of my visit over there with my girlfriend. Um, just a little bit of a trip and see who they are, what they do. Uh, I think I mentioned it before, it's about Nissan Z's. So yeah, that's still overdue. I'll still release it at some point. Um, it's from last summer actually. So yeah, um, we are on the way. It's like an hour and 15 to get there. You come along and yeah, let's have a look. Off we go. The Ripu finally has well, somewhat of a cap. <laughs> it's, uh, well, for the moment it's just sitting on top. Um, we just put it here because we cannot really start working on it until it gets a bit warmer, since it's still quite cold out here, around zero degrees. And plus, there's no space at my friend's place. Um, not that there was ever any space, but well, that's another story. So yeah, we got the cat back. Uh, I think you saw us um, unpacking it, which was actually a bad thing. Um, you do see some stains. Well, how white most of here, you can see some stains still, um, and especially over there. These brown-ish stains. Um, yeah, so I don't know what it is. It's some sort of liquid that spilled over it. Um, I've been trying to clean it here with uh, with acetone, so just to remove, to, to see really what is a stain and what is rust, because, and that's what I meant with unfortunate, it was still packed, you can see here it has uh, rust spots already again on the locations where it was spot welded. It's mostly on the hood as far as I can tell, um, it was also here. There was a lot of this this liquid and and everything, but um, yeah, I mean the most most will just be able to wipe be wiped off, which I'm doing right now. And if you look really other than that, I mean it looks awesome. I mean look at it, it's um, yeah, it looks really really good. It's just primed. It's not sanded yet. Um, that's what we intended to do. Oh, what I am intending to do. Um, however, the next step basically is to um, to get ourselves. Uh, well, the gimbal doesn't really let me turn it that much. Um, yeah. So the, the the thing is really that we are intending to um, prepare the, the the bridge that goes on the back um, because that one is still hanging under the roof of my friend's place. So I want to get it down bring it to the sandblasting place, get it cleaned up to see how bad it is underneath. And then those patch panels I'm intending to do myself, trying to, to really improve my skills there, because this was way too much for me, really way too much. So really, if we, if we have a look, if we go over here and, and check, I hope the light, well, I'll just take my phone. If you look here, I mean, it, it looks like new. As I said, there's still some, some liquid. I haven't cleaned up everything just yet, 
but if you look at it, it, it looks really, really good. Really nice. The guys did a, a tremendous job over in Lithuania and I, I can't wait to continue on it really. It's gonna take a bit longer. As I said, I'm just here, I will continue cleaning up. I will um, make sure that the spots, the spot wells uh, get a bit sanded and then um, covered over with epoxy. And then coming spring, the plan is to be ready also with the bridge. I need to see if that is feasible. It also depends a bit on my time. And then we will continue from there. But I'm really pumped. Um, also, if you look in here, camera is probably not doing it justice, but it, it looks quite good. The cab is not centered yet. You can see that the shifting console is a bit off to the right. And there's still like the other patch panels or the, the stuff that they took out. It's still in here. So I need to, to take it out, throw away what can be thrown away. And of course, I'll, I'll show you also the, the panel that was on the firewall, <laughs> because that's still in there. And quite interesting to see. Yeah, other than that, as I said, um, that is how it will be resting for a while until I get to, to be done with the cap. And then from there, we'll continue. All right, everyone, um, that has just been a quick update. Um, I hope I'll be able to continue quite soon and in a steady pace uh, getting this thing ready. And um, of course, I will take you along. Apologies for the long time there was not any update. I hope it becomes a bit more frequent going forward. Still a lot of stuff happening, which lets me partially uh, not continue working on, on my project. But hey, that's life. And guess it's the same for everyone. All right then, um, I'm looking forward to see you guys again. Um, and with that, that's a wrap. Thanks everyone for watching, take care and see you soon, bye bye.